Welcome. In front of me is an Okitel OKT1 and today I'll show you how you can bypass the Google verification on this tablet. So you can see that it is locked and yeah. So anyway, to get started, we will want to, number one, navigate to the Wi-Fi connection page. So I need to go back, but obviously if you're on the first page of the setup, you want to go forward. And from here, you will scroll down and then select see all Wi-Fi networks. Then you're going to scroll down even lower and you're going to select add a new network. This will bring up a keyboard with a microphone on the side of it, right? So you want to click on it and ask you for uh, access to Gboard to record audio. You want to select deny. Do that once again. Again, select deny. And you can see that right now it's just an outline. So we're going to select the button once more and then I'm going to select allow. This will take us to the app info page as you can see. And in here we're going to now select and quickly check. Gonna tap on permissions then we're gonna select search and we're gonna search for settings and you want to scroll all the way to the bottom so as you can see we have settings click on it and then you're gonna select open from here, navigate to apps and notifications. App info. Scroll down till you see Google Play services. Select disable, disable app for stop and <coughs> And OK. And from here, I'm going to now gonna select the now hold par key. And let me click C. OK, so we're going to select restart now. I'm uh, reading through the guide right now as I go. So that's why I'm kind of like stumbling a little bit. So bear with me. Anyway, once the device reboots, uh, we're going to go through the setup. Okay, so see, well now we're going to get back to the Wi-Fi connection page. So actually we need to go back in this case. There we go. We're gonna again go down. Now, key part, you should see set up offline option right now, but we won't be using it just yet. So again, we're gonna select uh, see all networks. Then we're gonna scroll again down and add network. Again, we're gonna select the allow option right here from a microphone, permissions, search, settings, Open. We're going to go back to the apps and notifications. App info. Google Play services. And now we're going to enable it. From here, once you have enabled it, you want to go back. Now, do it carefully so you don't go, go back too far. You want to get back to the page from Wi-Fi. So right here, I'm going to select Cancel. And now we're going to tap on Setup Offline. Continue. So from here, let's finish up the setup. 
quickly check. Okay, I'm gonna skip this. So there we go, now we have access to the home screen. Now there is one last step uh, that needs to be taken. So what you want to do is navigate into the settings. From there, scroll down to system, advanced, reset options, erase all data, erase all data, and press on that button once again to begin the factory reset of your device. Now, this will take some time on this tablet, so just be patient. Uh, it might take like 10 minutes or so uh, to finish it up. And once it's completed, you will be back in the setup screen. But don't worry, at that point, the device will be fully unlocked, so you can go through the setup however you want. Now, just to not waste anybody's time, I'm not going to go over this on the video just because it, it is a factory reset, which shows you literally nothing. And then it's a setup screen, which I'm pretty sure everybody knows how to go through. So once you press on that button, the device becomes unlocked. So anyway, this is how you can bypass the Google verification on this tablet. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.